infrastructure planning is broken. This is California's high-speed rail line designed to connect San Diego to San Francisco. It was approved as a 9 billion euro project, but after they actually talked to the property owners along the proposed path, it is now estimated to be a 64 billion euro project. It will also be the slowest high-speed rail ever built. Good job, America. But it's not just us. <laughs> this is probably a project you're all familiar with. This is Berlin's Brandenburg Airport. Two weeks before it opened, they figured out that engineers and planners had not been talking to each other. And now this project is 5 billion euros over budget and seven years behind schedule. And there are thousands of projects facing similar problems, which is why the world spends over 500 million euros every single day on infrastructure planning inefficiencies. And this is despite the fact that we spend 8 billion euros every year on infrastructure planning, design, and project management software. Ladies and gentlemen, something is not working. This is Nathan Korn, our founder and CEO. He worked for seven years as a transportation consultant. In order to do his job, he had to work across many different disciplines, from engineers to politicians to architects to economists to other planners to many different public stakeholders. This is an extremely time-consuming, expensive, and difficult process. Incompatible files bounce back and forth over email, going out of date the moment you click send. Meetings take months to schedule and reschedule. Requirement changes go barely noticed, if they're noticed at all, and it is impossible to get everyone on the same page. This is why a process that should take weeks instead takes years. We are Pedaris and we are fixing the way the world plans and designs its urban infrastructure. A planner like Nathan can use a planner like Nathan can use our tools to design transportation networks in the browser, anything from bicycle paths to tramways even to hyperloops. He can share his designs with other planners and other engineers and they can collaborate in the same document at the same time from anywhere in the world. Requirement changes are communicated in milliseconds rather than months, and when he's ready, he can share his design broadly with the public or with politicians and get feedback early in the design process, when it matters most. With Pedaris, we keep everyone on the same page. And we are happy to say that in our time at Startup Boot Camp, we have moved from a prototype to a real application. We are live today and we are making Pedaris easy to adopt. Public projects are free for anyone to work on, but as privacy is needed, we charge a low monthly fee that scales with the number of collaborators. This gives us low barrier access to the customers that matter most, the planners themselves. They will be our natural advocates in a very conservative industry. Of course, Feasibility planning is one thing, but today nobody is doing detailed design and engineering in a web application. There are plenty of sophisticated desktop applications that handle that. The problem is none of them talk to each other. With Pedaris, we will not compete with these companies, we will integrate with them. The same core technology that allows us to synchronize people also allows us to synchronize software. Over the next six months, we will release an open API and begin development on plugins for major software packages. This will allow us to, keep, to bring everyone onto the same page from day one in the design process and keep them there throughout the process. But we need your help. Today, we are asking for 450,000 euros in initial seed funding to ramp up our development and build our marketing and outreach. We have a team that can pull this off. We have worked and collaborated together for a long time, and we have deep knowledge of software engineering and the infrastructure planning, uh, <laughs> infrastructure planning 
process. We hope you'll join us because we believe infrastructure planning needs better tools. It needs Podaris. Thank you.